Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. Do you have multiple sources of income, multiple streams of income? If so, then you're on track most likely to be getting more money into your life and to be building wealth. And so there are people that say it's not about multiple sources of income and that's not how you get wealthy. But typically I would argue that you would have a system that would be able to funnel different things, or maybe it is one thing that you focus on, right? We do need to have a main focus, but it might funnel and lead to other things like YouTube, people have AdSense, then they also have affiliates and sponsorships and products and multiple ways to get more money. And so in my opinion, the more income streams you can have, the better. Yes, you do need to have focus on at least one, right? If you're just focusing on all these different ones, you can't build all of your income streams, but there's a lot of even simple income streams that you can do without causing your attention to have to be on all of those things. Like if I had a dog walking business and I had this business and I had that, and then my kids and this, it would be a lot. And so I want to share currently what sources of income and streams of income my husband and I have. We are working on creating more and we're just getting started with really expanding and on exploding our wealth journey. But I want to share what we've currently done and what's helped us in hopes that it can help you. Let's do it. All right. So the first income stream is a really common one for most people. And so if you have a day job and so I have a day job, but then I would say our next income stream would be my husband's day job. And so not everybody has that, right? You have two day jobs. So that's boom, boom, two sources of income. And so we have both of our jobs and both of our incomes combining together to create another income stream. And so this is really helpful. It's a blessing to be able to have a job and to be able to have money coming in. So I'm super grateful for that. But if you want to build true wealth, you will use that income to buy assets and to create other income streams. Great. The third income stream, if you count the both day jobs as two different income streams, would be finding a side hustle or something that you can do that doesn't take too much time. Or if you do want to take a lot of time on it, go for it. But we actually are dog sitters. So we have people in our neighborhood that need help and we love being able to help them. It's close, it's convenient. And so it helps them, but then it also helps us. So we do make a little bit of extra money. And so that technically is another income stream. Now, could you scale that? Could you have a dog walking business and do people make tens of thousands and hundreds of thousands of dollars by having a business like that on the side or as a main business? Absolutely. But it does require time. It is one of those trading your time for money. And so that's a great way to make money is trading your time for money. But if you want to build true wealth and you also want to have that time, which is part of what I advocate for and what I want, I want to have time with my son. I want to have time with my family. I want to have time working on my health and serving other people, right? I want to have the time to choose. That's what it's really about for me. And so be mindful about side hustles or things that um, will trade your time for money. It could be a helpful thing, but just be mindful of that and see what you're really getting yourself into. Number three, with teaching or with your current job, there might be other sources of income, right? So I make a base salary, but then if I do certain extra things like coaching or there's tutoring after school, um, or there's certain things in your job, right? So during the normal workday, there's actually more ways to make money. And so I encourage you with your job are there ways to make money where you're currently at? Can you, do you have to put in more hours to get more money, like overtime or things of that nature? Or is there a way to make more money in your current job? Like in teaching, you could pick up an extra class. There are certain things that you could be doing or responsibilities that would get paid more. And so take a look at that both after your job time. If you work nine to five, is there something after? Again, that's taking away some of your time, but especially if you're young or if you just need it, maybe that's what you need to do, but also find ways to make money within your current job and to think about also how to get maybe a raise or to get more money if there aren't really any other options besides just making more money. Can you do more projects? Can you do more and say, if I bring in this amount of money, can I get a percentage of it or can I get a raise, et cetera? Number four, so this one is affiliate marketing. And so it's a way you might have seen with different people online. And this was with regular businesses, but a lot of people have started to do this. And so say you like a product and then 
you become an affiliate for it and you share it and you'd be using this product anyways. And so for me, this is with Sun Warrior Vanilla Plant Protein. And honestly, they have so many more products. And so, but that's just my main favorite one and their greens, powders, etc. But they have so many products. And so I'm going to buy these products anyways. And I tell anyone when they ask me, hey, what protein powder do you recommend? Or hey, what's the, what is the greens powder that you recommend? I tell them Sun Warrior. And so what's cool about this is that I'm using the product anyways. I I'm telling someone else anyways. And so the benefit is you work with the company to share their product because then more people will buy their product, right? But then you get a kickback. So you might get a percentage. And so I started working with somewhere. If you're interested, please don't feel like you have to, but use the code Elizabeth for 20% off. Seriously, they have organic and amazing products. I highly recommend it if that's what you're into. I know a lot of people follow for the smoothies and those types of recipes. So if you're wondering what protein powder I use, it's amazing and it's the best tasting one that I've ever had. And they have tons of other products. And so affiliate marketing is another income source and another way to make more money. Such big companies, they make a lot of money just by being an affiliate. And to me, it's a win-win. Like I always feel weird and especially coming into this, I just want to help people, but you also, it's okay asking for money or it's okay receiving money, right? It doesn't mean you're a bad person. I think that's a big thing a lot of people have to work through and get over, especially if you are more of that service oriented and you don't really want to just get the money. It's like, I just want to, I just want to tell you about it. Right. But if you're going to tell someone about it anyways, if you're going to use the product about it anyways, why don't you go ahead and get that kickback? It's okay. Number six would be a high yield savings account. And so I have a whole video on this, the easiest form of passive income. And I didn't even think of it as passive income, but it's so interesting. I talked to someone about it and they're like, it's passive income. And it is because you're making money on your money. And so don't just put your money in a regular savings account if you can, especially if it's a big amount of money. And so we have our family emergency savings and we want to have that money set aside that's not actually invested, but we don't want it to just make no money, right? And it's losing money with inflation. And so we put it in betterment. Um, at the time, it was 5.5% APY, which the S&P 500 returns 8 to 10%. And so that's really, really good on your money. You're getting money and it's working for you while, while you sleep, which is what you want. Number seven. So a step up from this is investments, stocks. So if you have stocks, bonds, investments, you are making money. You're getting dividends on the money that you invest and your money is growing and working for you. And so I highly recommend getting invested and starting investing. You do not have to pick individual stocks, but you can. Low cost index funds will do the trick if you just want to go with those and stick with those. Um, it's been shown to give you at least an eight to 10 percent of a return over time. And so definitely check that out. But having those investments, that is honestly my favorite way. I'm still learning about real estate and would love to get a real estate as um, passive income one day. You could even look into a REIT, which is something interesting that a lot of people do if you don't want to quite get invested in real estate, but you do want to take advantage of the real estate market. And so that's another option as well. All right. So a few more ways you could have products. You could have something that you sell. Maybe you have art or you create things and you want to sell those things. Or maybe you write a book. There's lots of people who have written books like Ali Abdal just wrote a book. Um, There's email marketing. There's real estate, like I talked about in REITs, you could get more into that. A lot of people buy investment properties. I know the economy is a little different right now, but even bigger people or people who have more money, they buy not just single family homes or apartments, they buy apartment complexes, or you could have storage units. There's so many different things you could do. You could have treasury yield bonds, which are also um, making more money on the money you put in and you get that interest back. You could own patents, you can own businesses. There's so many possibilities for getting passive income and for getting your money working for you. So let me know if this video was helpful. Let me know if you want me to make a longer video or a more expanded video on different types of passive income and how you can make passive income or more income for yourself. Let me know if you want a video on side hustles. I'd be happy to share that information with you and do a little bit more research. Um, Feel free to let me know in the comments below. What sources of income do you have? Do you have multiple sources of income? Do you just have one? What are you going to work on, right? Maybe you don't have it yet, but you want to work on it. Let me know in the comments below. Feel free to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Share with a friend. Subscribe for more and I will see you in the next video. Keep learning, working, and growing. You can build more wealth for your family. You can create the life that you've dreamed and you can create the life that you dream for others. Let's do it and let's join together. I believe in you. You got this. Bye guys.